If we can keep our competitors focused on us while we stay focused on the customer, ultimately we'll turn out all right. In the old world, you devoted 30% of your time to building a great service and 70% of your time to shouting about it. In the new world, that inverts. If you're not stubborn, you'll give up on experiments too soon. And if you're not flexible, you'll pound your head against the wall and you won't see a different solution to a problem you're trying to solve. A brand for a company is like a reputation for a person. You earn reputation by trying to do hard things well. Complaining is not a strategy. You have to work with the world as you find it, not as you would have it be. As a company grows, everything needs to scale, including the size of your failed experiments. If the size of your failures isn't growing, you're not going to be inventing at a size that can actually move the needle. If you only do things where you know the answer in advance, your company goes away. If you're competitor focused, you have to wait until there is a competitor doing something. Being customer focused allows you to be more pioneering. There are two ways to extend a business. Take inventory of what you are good at and extend out from your skills. Or determine what your customers need and work backwards, even if it requires learning new skills. Where you are going to spend your time and your energy is one of the most important decisions you get to make in life. If you can make a decision with analysis, you should do so. But it turns out in life that your most important decisions are always made with instinct and intuition, taste, heart. Life's too short to hang out with people who aren't resourceful. The best customer service is if the customer doesn't need to call you, doesn't need to talk to you. It just works. People who are right most of the time are people who change their minds often. Put the customer first. Invent. And be patient. Work hard, have fun and make history. I knew that if I failed I wouldn't regret that, but I knew the one thing I might regret is not trying.